Have you been feeling down, depressed, or hopeless? I am actually bleeding. Good morning, friends. I have a doctor's appointment later and I'm here at my boyfriend's house which makes my drive time an hour to the hospital but um, as long as I finish this in five minutes we'll be on time I didn't get to sleep well last night I don't know you guys my anxiety has been bad lately to the point that I knocked off my nail I'm trying to get my shit together and this is like day one I am going to go to my appointment even though I didn't want to wake up earlier and our drive time would be like longer because like I said I will be coming from my boyfriend's house this is really unnecessary but I just want to look presentable and put together today so um there's nothing bad going on with me i i just want to start having my regular you know annual health exam or you know checkup and this is year one i don't know kung ngayon na namin gagawin yun but i probably would have to go back to other appointments to do the actual health checkup but still I at least I'm making progress so yeah I think this also should be a reminder for you guys to make time for your health that there's nothing wrong going to the doctor and getting your regular you know checkups because it's really good for you and it's so important to be on top of our health so that's what we're gonna do today I am not going to be taking Rio with me because it's Friday today, it's going to be weekend anyway. I'm not going to do any work or kung meron man, um, brands wouldn't really approve of it because it's the weekend. So I think after the checkup, ko, I also have gym. So after gym, I would go back here. So I would leave Rio and some of my things. So. Yeah, let's go. Okay, let's go. Whew. I haven't eaten anything yet, but just in case, I do keep a sky flakes over here. This is one of my car essentials. Iba na yung packaging niya. I don't know kung ganito na ba lahat ng sky flakes or yung nabili ko lang dito sa US. So let me know actually, but yeah, just in case I gutom ako, I keep Skyflakes here in my car. Okay, let's go. Let's get this shit done. In one mile, turn right. Okay, I'm very grateful that the weather good today because last night it was snowing and um, I was kind of debating whether I, sh I should cancel my appointment or not but I'm glad that it's clear today Curious. from crazy not tell you about me arrived I'm just gonna finish this and then I'll get in there. <laughs> Guys, I did something very, very stupid. So I locked my keys inside my car and my apartment keys are also inside my car but I have been chill 
I'm not stressed. I'm trying not to be stressed. Because somehow I figured out what to do. But um, yeah, I'll go home to my apartment, take the Uber, and just figure shit out there. I know I have my car key duplicate. If you guys remember from our last Vlogmas episodes, I did that. So that's good. But right now, um, I'm still waiting to be called. I just want to get this doctor's appointment over with and we'll deal with this matter later so yeah i just wanted to give you guys an update that i did something very stupid <laughs> in the last two weeks have you been feeling down depressed or hopeless probably anxious Okay, just mostly anxious. Okay. Oh my god, we're back in my car. Oh my god, I don't want to do that ever again. It was so much work. What the heck? I feel like I just got my period. Let me breathe for a second. Buti na lang talaga I did my car key duplicate last time. Because I just know that my dumb self could do this. I mean, could do what I just did earlier. And um, also, I'm happy that my apartment office was kind enough to, you know, open my room, my apartment for me. Yung isa sa mga ladies there at my apartment office told me that I can also call my insurance, my car insurance company in case, you know, all else fails and that I lock my keys inside my car. So if you guys ever put yourself in this kind of situation, either go get your car key duplicated or, like I said, if all, all else fails, go call your car insurance company and then they should be able to help you unlock your car. About my doctor's appointment kanina, it was fine. My doctor was a lady. She's nice, quite young, and she just did like an annual physical exam. To me, tapos, I just ask questions about my panic attacks, my, my like, pap smear thingy. Because I just want to be on top of my reproductive health because in my family, we have, like, a history of, you know, reproductive health something. So... I actually have no idea kung ano yung pap smear, but it's just something to check your reproductive health. So, malalaman ko once I get it done. And I'd have to call like two different medical centers or medical places. One for me to do my lab tests, like my blood my thyroid and i don't know what this other one is but these are like my lab orders so yun lang yun yung parang pinagawa ko today actually hindi ka naman i-require magpa lab test kung gusto mo lang but since like i told my doctor i want to just check my health overall so that's why i asked her to you know, um, do this for me. And another appointment pa yung pap smear. And then about my panic attacks, I was prescribed a medication. I was telling my doctor I don't really want to start any medication. But then she told me that this medication, she's going to start me on a very, I mean, on the lowest dose. And then um, see how the medication would treat me. And then... Um, 
Sabi niya, wala naman daw kasing side effects. I can eat whatever, take it, even on an empty stomach, and I'll be good. So, I should be taking it every day, though. Yun lang. Kasi yung iba, parang, ano mo lang ititake kapag nagka-panic attack ka. But, sabi niya, that wouldn't help prevent panic attacks in the long term. So, this one, something that I would take every day would help would help me for longer term. So, I'll see how the medication would treat me. So, I have to pick up that medication sa pharmacy, but I don't think it's available today kasi, you know, kaka-prescribe lang. Well, actually, let me call the pharmacy and see. Look, I really think I got my period. Please say your date of birth or enter it on your keypad and- Ah! You're taking too long. I am just gonna go home, eat oats, and change to my workout clothes because it's leg day today and I'm so excited even though I really think I have- I just had my period so I am actually bleeding today, so I wore some thongs with his leggings, with panty liners, and I'm wearing my menstrual cup inside, so that's how I'm dealing with it right now. And I'm also wearing some compressive leggings. These are from set active i'm really not feeling my best today i'm kind of just freestyling my day trying to get things done today's gym outfit good that was perfect I had such a funky workout today. I don't know, maybe because I had my period today, my energy is just so low, or it's because I only had sky flakes. I didn't eat oats earlier when I get home, you guys, because I had no time. So now I'm feeling a little funky and dizzy. 